question 11 deals with a limit as usual we're going to try direct substitution if it works then our job is done but usually it doesn't work okay let's see square root of 25 minus 5 divided by 25 minus 25 uh, it's 5 minus 5 which is 0 over 0 so it doesn't work this is called an indeterminate form okay so now we need to try algebraic manipulation and what we're going to do is we're going to try multiplying the rational function by the conjugate. Okay, so let's just write the function over h minus 25. Parenthesis will help us. So we're using parenthesis. Now the conjugate of square root of h minus 5 is square root of h plus 5. So we multiply by square root of h plus 5. We go. So we get square root of h square, which is h minus 5 square, which is 25. And we leave the denominator the way it is because we can cancel. Let's just multiply the numerator by 1. And we leave the denominator the way it is. So h minus 25 cancel. So a simpler expression of our function is 1 over square root of h plus 5. And both limits should be the same. However, this limit can be obtained by direct substitution. So it's 1 over square root of 25 plus 5. So it's going to be 1 over 5 plus 5, which is 1 over 10. And I said this is our answer. We just have to write the original problem. Limit of square root of h minus 5 over h minus 25 as h approaches 25 is 1 over 10. The correct answer is C. See you with the next question.